Hey everybody, it's Wednesday afternoon. I'm here at Fisherman's Landing here in San Diego. We're going to be going out on the uh, Pacific Dawn this evening. Uh, they fished a week ago and got into some bluefin tuna. That's what I'm hoping for. That's why we're down here. We are going out of Fisherman's Landing on Pacific Dawn. We got a, my buddy Dave here. He's fished before on the Dolphin on a half day with me. We got these guys are getting all lined up. We are headed out fishing for a day and a half on the Pacific yeah. Dawn. If you don't want to be in this video, you got to tell me and I'll try and cut you out. <laughs> But if you don't mind being in it, ham it up and make make some noise we're, for these people. We're going to go out and get medieval on them. Uh, we're going to go out and slay them. That's what I hope. Hope we get into a school and we can uh, catch one, one and a half a piece. I'll be happy. Uh, that, yeah. Uh, yeah. If I, catch, if, I catch, be nice. if I get one, I'll be, I'll, my, it'll make my trip. Anything okay. more than that's a bonus. Okay, so do you guys fish on these boats very often? I fished on the Royal Polaris three years ago and did pretty well, but uh, I haven't been on a boat since. Oh. This, this guy here, I live in Wyoming. Okay. I came a long, you came, came a long ways. Yeah. Oh, so you're a bow hunter. <laughs> bow hunter. Yeah. I mean, you know, shooting one of these with a bow would be a lot of fun. Oh, yeah. It would be, it would be self, self uh, so what's mutilation. Your, <laughs> so what's your personal best in a bluefin tuna? So far, 60 pounds. 60? And how about you, sir? I've never fished for... These oh, big of fish. Okay. Uh, I've had enough fun with 30 pounders. Yeah. Well, I stuff under 50 that kick my ass that I'm like, I don't think I need to go for these big fish. You know what? A couple of 30 pounders puts a lot of meat in the freezer, so yeah, it's always yeah, fun. Yeah, I, I would be more than happy to catch a few, you know, under a few under 100. And, and <laughs> then kinda, you just ship. I, I'm prepared for the big ones, but I'm I'm, I'm scared to death. Like, I'm actually hooking one up. You'll put them in your freezer next to the black Angus. Oh yeah. I, well, and a hog. So anyways, we're headed out. We're going to catch some fish. We'll be back yeah, Friday morning. This, this video will post at 5 o'clock on Monday. Alright, we're getting ready to leave on the Pacific Dawn. There's the guys fishing this trip. Here we go. Okay, on this trip, I'm going to give you an idea of what I'm fishing. I'm fishing my, uh, my Makara here. It's a 16. It's in this really cool blue camo. And this is one of the mates on the boat. What's your name, man? Brad. And this yeah. is Brad down here. He's gonna take good care of us on this trip. He's gonna stick my 150 pounder. So you'll see this while we're out there, but I've got a 60 pound leader on the front end here. Uh, fishing a 60 pound line with a 100 pound backer. Uh, fishing my usual rip roller here. You can see this thing's got a lot of teeth marks in it. We've caught a ton of fish with it. Then I'm going to rig up this Avid over here. It's 30 pounds. I'm going to drop a 40 pound leader on the front of it. And then I am going, I'm going to fish this evening, depending on what size fish we get into. I'm going to start with this, uh, I forgot what it's called. But we've sure caught a bunch of fish on this guy too. Look, at, he is all scarred up. So that's what we're doing. We're gonna go out and have a great trip. The fish are out there. We're gonna find them. The bite's gonna be on. This is Brandon, right? Yeah, Brandon. All right, and did you wrap this rod? No, I did not. I did not wrap this one. Okay. It is, if you look here, the guides are actually spiraling around the pole. Oh yeah. And actually, and at the bottom of the pole, so it bends like that. Okay. So what that does is when you're jigging, at night with for bluefin, you're able to impart more action on the jig going up and down like this. Okay. And the pole will flex more. It's more of a, what's called moderate action. So it will impart more action onto the jig so it can actually flutter how they're designed to. Okay. Um, so this is more of a traditional style pole for running these jigs. And, and what jig are you fishing? I'm fishing a West Coast Jiggers, shout out uh kb 300 gram okay 300 gram i'm fishing a 300 gram rip roller i love so. those too those are my other favorite and then your real what what do you've got there i got a shimano osha jigger um okay. 4000 which is again designed for 
imparting the right action. And the difference between what a lot of people who watch your channel will notice is this is actually a star drag. Right. Not a lever, not the standard drag system that you would use, but this can actually put out 40 pounds of drag. Okay, so you, so you could easily land a 150, 200 pound fish on this rod. Not easily. I was about to never, say easily is a stretch. It's, ne <laughs> it's never easy with these guys because they don't ever stop fighting. No, but, but but the rod and reel are designed for that size fish. All right. Well, thanks, Brandon. Welcome. We're going to get out there. Yeah. And I'm going to show what always happens. Anytime we yeah. go fishing, we stop right here at the bait barge. Okay, so we got Captain Mike down there scooping. And now I for. I've forgotten everybody's name, so when you come around, what's your name, man? I'm Ryan. That's Ryan. And who are you? Brad. Ryan Brad. and Brad. Uh, and I don't Charlie. remember Charlie. All right. So that's going to be our main crew. And then we got Cheeseburger in cooking for us on this trip. His name is Good looking bait. And we always got the bathing beauties out here on the front. Check those guys out. Meat eater? I'm a meat eater, yeah. We got a hey, cheeseburger going here. He's yes, making, my buddy. He's making me Fresh a special meat. sandwich here. Four meatballs. He's, he's going to put four meatballs on that thing, I think. Check that out. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, meatballs. Yeah, baby, meatballs. <laughs> Meatballs. There we go. Did you did you make those meatballs? I made them fresh, baby. <laughs> All right. Handcrafted. Handcrafted, baby. Nick Cheeseburger. Here we go. There we go. Thank you very much. You're very welcome, buddy. Here we go. We're gonna see the first bites. Yeah, baby, baby. Oh, pork. There we go. Yeah, baby, ready? All right. What number? I got you, buddy. I got you, buddy. Good food should make you dance a little. There you go. First stop of the night. We got these guys trying. Yeah, good, good practice run. Did he say how deep they were? 300. Oh, only 300? Hey, here we go. This is my first drop. He said uh, 360 feet. As you guys know, have watched my videos, I got 300. Okay, there goes 300. All right, well, this is the second drop. I'm out, I don't know, 450 feet, but look how far out I'm scoped out too. So, I'm gonna reel back up and hopefully I come. Third stop. Sun's just starting to come up. I'm still got my rip roller on. It's pretty nasty out here. I'm just about out to 320, 340 feet. Fish are supposed to be down at 240, but I'm really scoping out. So when you're scoping out, I've got 450 feet out at about a 45 degree angle. So I'm really down about 225 feet. So I'm just getting down, barely getting down to the fish and not getting bit. So Brandon switched to live bait there. What do you got? About 20 ounces on there and a- Only 16. Only 16 ounces. And look at the size of that sardine. So it's almost like a sinker rig. It is a sinker rig. It's just drop shot. It's a, like thing. drop shotted. So it's a different way to fish them. Never fish them that way. But it sure makes sense because you're not twisting up going down. That's the whole point. You can bomb it down there in the waves <laughs> and not worry about it getting twisted up on the way down. That one that just went past looked like it was about eight feet. Yeah. <laughs> we got some biggies out here. We're having fun. Rough weather, rough weather blooping. Look at these guys, they're all smiling. Are we? <laughs> we got birds in the background. We got fish underneath <laughs> us. We need we, blood on the boat. We need bloody decks. <laughs> okay, so we got Billy here. He makes tuna spikes for fun. I don't know why, but um, here's, why, do, why do you make tuna spikes, Billy? Just for fun, just for something to do. Here's the tag. Oh, that was cool. Oh, there you go. Yeah. That's a little tabby. different. 
We got the Mexican flag. Okay. <laughs> a little bit of turquoise on the ends, you know. Is, it? is this the Jamaica? This is the Jamaica. That's the Jamaica. Oh, that's nice. Okay, there's there's just the uh, tuna man. Yeah, nice. Okay. Hey. Oh, oh. Here's, here's the rust. So we're back. We're back on live here. The last thing we saw was the Rasta, the Rasta sticker over there. Rasta sticker. All right. And is this the Brazilian flag? Uh, Jamaican. Oh, Jamaican flag. Okay. And and then we got a zebra one coming out of the packet. This is just Africa. Okay, so is there a T handle in this? Is it's, what? It's filled up with glue inside of it. It's just a piece of pipe. Okay, so it's a piece of pipe filled with glue, and so is that just a straight spike then into there? Because yep. there's because there's no real tension on it to pull it out like a gaff material yeah, or anything. Just, it's just a quick put them out of the misery and um, get them down below deck. Have you used any of these yet? No, this is the this is the maiden voyage right here. Okay, and you're hoping to kill one with each. If I could use all of them, that'd be awesome. <laughs> Thanks, Billy. Thank you. Thank that's, you a dark, for, uh, that's a long dart from the 70s. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they were what, yards? Yeah, yards. <laughs> okay, this is third or fourth stop of the day. So check out the ocean. It's looking a little angry out there. Having fun? Oh, it's settling. Oh, I can't control myself. <laughs> The captain tells us there's some fish here. I believe him, but we haven't seen one yet. We want some bloody decks today. If I get a good cast in, I'm passing my 300 mark when it's straight up and down. Yeah, that's good. But this time, I, I had a bad cast. There goes 200. I'm straight up and down at two goes 300 feet 300 foot that way or no i'm almost <laughs> i'm almost down You're down on a good cast i'm at 300 feet as i'm passing the boat okay but that was a bad cast i was at 200 feet passing the boat okay so i'm probably out i don't i don't have 400 marked on it okay so Go ahead and drop down again, 40 fathoms, it's coming underneath the boat. Please throw a scoop over the side and start uh, throwing twos and threes. It's coming up this time, it's not dropping off the boat. Please hurry up and get a scoop in the water. It's coming underneath this really thick. Hey, do the same right now. Please. It's a nice school. It's finally, uh, I like that. I got almost 360 straight down. There's 300. Come on, baby, be in here. Still doing it. We got eight foot squeeze out, seas out here. Everybody's feeling them. Cook's been doing a great job trying to keep everybody fed up. We keep seeing fish. They're all down deep, 60 to 80 fathoms. So it's tough to get down that far. And I don't believe anybody's had a bite yet. It's probably about 1130 or so. So I don't think I've shown you this, but what I'm doing is I'm casting as far out as I can with the wind and then walk into the other side of the boat and I'm somewhere around 360 feet deep as we pass the boat I let it out to about 400 I'm just gonna see if we can get something to hit this Colt sniper nothing they're not hitting the live baits we're not not had a bite yet the captain just said, nah, reel them in, we're gonna leave. And then he said, here they come, get them back down. So 
I'm hoping somebody gets hooked up pretty soon so I can do some filming for you people so you like this stuff. There's my 200 mark right there going into the water. There's, there's my 300 mark still on the reel. I'm straight up and down, so it's about time for it to come off. Yep, there it goes. So I'm 300, I'm not quite straight up and down. Plus I have about 30 feet a liter on here. No, I don't, I have about six feet a liter. So I'm somewhere around 350, 360 feet right now, letting it still just drop straight down. Let's just hope something comes up and eats it on the way in. If you watch my reel, you'll see my 300 foot mark. There it is. I'm just gonna send it back down. We are rocking, there's eight foot seas. We're sideways, half the people are seasick on this boat. And the captain said the stuff decided not to come back. So rather than cast out, I'm putting it away until we find another school. <laughs> so what kind of shark do we have? Oh, it's a blue? All right, people, we're out on the Pacific Dawn. Fish are underneath the boat. Look at that. It's been like that all day long. They haven't been biting, but I think our luck's about to change. So here we go. Thanks, man. Oh, boy, Lilac. All right. All right, we got a biter here. It came off. Came off. Okay, we're getting some boils off the boat. So I've I've switched to fly lining. And get this guy out there. We've had we had three or four hookups. We've lost them all. We fished all day long. You saw the screen just before the fish started hitting. Okay, so you ne gotta be never too proud to ask. So I just asked Charlie to pick me up the right bait, get him swimming out there. This one's all on you, buddy. I got it. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Charlie's good luck. Somebody's gotta be good luck. I've tried everything I know today. Oh, you don't want to get him hooked up too? No, that's all you right there. Okay, buddy. Was that you, sir? <laughs> Let's look at this hook. Enjoy it. Look again. First a close-up up to your lens. Yeah, there right you there. There you go. And then the hooker. The, 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 the circle hook. Do not use those mustad hooks. No, this, well, this one wasn't. I don't know what this was. I don't know what it is. I don't know. What hook was he saying don't use? Mustad, yeah. That's what I thought. Mustad is going to be blamed for any bad hook now. I think that was, I think it was decent, but maybe not. Look at, look at that. Wow. Was it a big fish, sir? I have no idea. <laughs> you think a 30 pounder did that? Uh, it could have been. Not even doing much. Uh, wow. I don't, I don't think it was a 30 pounder. Those are big. Huh? I don't think so either. Well, so, um, see, you're fishing a sardine, obviously. Yeah. And were you on a sinker rig? I had a Sinker rig, 15 ounce. Yeah, 15 ounces right. below the hook or above the hook? Below the hook. Okay. I've tried that today. I've tried jigging today. I've tried fly lining today. I don't know what's going to do it, but I'm going to get a bite before this trip is over. At least we got some action. You hooked up, Ben? That you, Benny, hooked up? Yeah. All right. If you guys have a lot of scope, you 
you're going to want to wind up and chest down swell as far as you can. How deep are you? Have one of us guys. You guys have to straight how, how the boat. All right, Ben. We fished all day. Sir? It's time to go home, and we finally found the school, and all pandemonium has broke out. Keep going, bud. You gotta go. You gotta go. Turn in. Turn in. There you go. Good missile, that thing. Keep going. Keep going. Follow me. We just pulled one right at color, so. Woo! Coming this Keep going, way. Make guys. Some room, guys. Take a step back. All right, how you doing? We're making it. We got 50 fathoms of fish out of the boat. We got 50 fathoms of fish. We were headed for home. I'd already clipped my lines, put my cameras away, and now I'm rigging the Makara because these are big fish. There we go. That's a real one. Let's go. That is a real one. Captain Mike, way to go, buddy. Good job. <laughs> Look at that bad yes, boy. Sir. What do you think, 140? Oh, I don't know, but it's a good one. You got hooked up, Levon? Yeah. All right, buddy. You ready? Okay. Put that tension on there. Let me know. He landed the one at the back, about 140. 140? Yeah. That's, that's my guess. How you doing? If you're not big, you're not yeah, deep angle, enough. Angle that ankle, buddy. If you have that much angle, you're never going to get down there, guys. Wind up. Yeah. Buddy! Oh, we missed him. Keep on, keep on. Never yell biter. I Yeah, he was gone instantly. Oh, a lot of fish on us. Keep going. I was 300 I had 300 out, but I scoped so probably 150. Is he still there? He was an awesome fish though. Fighter her! Another one! Other way. Guys, Other you gotta way. work your angles. We're out. He's climbing that down. Can I see rough? Absolutely. It just cleared. Oh, it. you got her. Nice. Perfect. You're gonna come underneath or come over the top. Good job, guys. Work together. Keep sliding that down to your left. Coming down, angled out. Guys, if you're not hooked up, wind up if you're out in oblivion. Go bow or stern. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Coming down. Guys, you can't have angles like this going all the way out. There you are. Okay, we got a fish right here. Okay. That's your rod? Yeah, that's your rod. Sorry, you do that. Are you recording? You want me to find the cover? I got him. I cut it out. Come down, guys. Keep going. I'm going to wind up still. As you can see, all pandemonium has broke out on the boat. 
People were climbing in bed. I was in bed when we found this school on the way home. It just became a phenomenal trip. I got a big one. I can't even lift this off the rail. <laughs> yeah. I am. My butt. My drag's a little tight. Follow though, guys. Stay, stay on top of please. All the way up. Go all the way up to the south. Come down. Come down. Low bridge, buddy. Coming down. Coming down. Coming down. You guys, we got some coming together here. Hey, I got one coming at you. All right, I gotta go. Turn the handle, guys. Whew. Oh, shit. Four lines at cousin. Come on, Jim. Jim, come on. Go keep power. All right. Come on, come on. I gotta go back over you. No problem. Are you ready? Good job, Matt. Coming to the third. I got a real one on this time. Yep, go over me. There you go. Keep fishing, guys. This is our chance. You're gonna follow us to the stern. Keep going to the stern with that. Can I see your rod? You can take it. I'm happy for you to have it for a minute, Charlie. No worries. Just follow me. I'm following. No, he's good. This is that white spectrum that's right there. Go, 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 go! Who's right there? Who's right Mine. You ready? Not really, but yeah. <laughs> here you go. Thank you. Right, How you doing, buddy? You work good right here? Let's get you, you in this corner right here. Can we get in this corner right here? Just take a step back and go to the right or the left. We ain't got to kill this thing in the corner so it doesn't get stuck in the prop. It's straight up and down. All right, this one's straight up and down on one side. Four going. Five going. Watch him. He's under the boat a little bit. All right. Coming, coming, coming. All chaos has hit. As far as you can, 
It took every bit of a day and a half. It's about 10 o'clock. You can, absolutely. Keep going. You got him, all right? Hey, Matt. Yeah, I'm gonna float him so we don't get stuck in any shit. I'm gonna okay. kill him. Yeah, if we need to get out! Okay, I'm flying now. Flying down. Charlie. Yo. You mind? Right? No. I need help. Who needs help here? Both of us, but he can go. Mine's out farther. You got color right there. Yeah. yeah. Any second? Third? Get it again. Be third? Come on, come on. Thanks, man. Of course, no problem. Good job, boys. Fuck! You alright? I need another gap in a second, Charlie. Hey, Charlie, in two minutes, I'm gonna have Two minutes, I got you. I got to take No, I know it's Seven? Seven. Oh, there he goes again. Alright, watch that angle, watch that angle. See how close you are to the boat? You have to with that short rod. You either gotta get it all the way out yourself, or here, let me see this. Let me help you out for a second. Yeah. 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 Sorry. Good job, Brandon. There's some on that pull. I think I got my personal best coming. I hope he just keeps coming.
gas. Up there already. Oh, there's there. I was like, I didn't. Sorry. No, no. He wanted to make sure you had the gas ready. I didn't see the gas. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, for the last half hour. Careful dropping out here, bud. You're gonna get all these hands up, so go to the front. Yeah, that way. Okay. You gotta get in the corner here. Chest as far as you can that way, and you'll be good. You yeah. ready? Let's go, cousin Jim. I'm trying. Get him, dog. He's got. He's got me. Okay, I'm getting close, guys. You're gonna be tank. You're over me, man. You're over my line. Okay, I got him here. We got color. Oh. Yeah, please. Mm. Oh. Ah. Oh. Keep on Come all the way back into that other corner. Watch out, guys. Come down. 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 Come Perfect. Oh. One, 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 one. Coming in right now. One, one, one. Oh, oh, wait, 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 one second. Here it comes. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, oh. oh. Woo! I'll take him. Cousin G! Woo, thanks, hey, man! You, you know. Nice gal. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Here, you want to take that one far? Yeah. Take another one? Oh, right here, take that one, actually. Okay. This one's fast. Alright, what number are you? 15. Good job. Oh. Alright, sweet. A nice fish. Oh, thanks. Coming in right behind. That one's good. Okay, that one awesome. This one's on the surface right here, about right 60 out. Right behind. 60 out. Nice. Woo! Got him? Yeah! I got mine. Get over there, buddy. Oh. What do you think, Charlie? What was that? What do you think, man? It's great. Hey, we need a second in the stern. I know. That's what we waited for. 12th eight, 9th inning, All 12 yeah. rounds of bugs. We were walking to the dugout. Watch out, guys. coming in. Right behind you. I got it. You good? You yep. good? You got it? You got it? I got, I got it. it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> you hooked up, buddy. 
Whew. Great train. Yeah. Uh, we get bit when Cozy Sue's on the boat. Back here, back here. I can't get anything on this guy. Whew. Thanks for gaffing me, buddy. Yeah, that's true. Oh. Yeah, another one bites the dust. Oh! Oh, thank you. A beast. Oh, big fish. Oh, yeah. Oh. Run. Oh. Oh, buddy. Oh. Oh. Hey, good job, dude. He's a beast. Oh, that's a beast. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Run, how was that? That's all. Yeah! Can we try that right That's back That's so here, great! Is, it, is that your first yeah, bluefin? Yeah! Right yeah, dude! Oh. Yeah! I can show up for my whole life! Good job, dude. Good job, man. Oh. Huge! That's bigger than I ever caught. Oh. Good job, man. Great job. Oh! My whole life is There's another nice one. Oh, man. Oh, man. Whoo! What? Guys, you need to come through. How's the barrel going? Are you hooked up? Yeah, right here. Oh, you got color? Okay. Red! Yeah, I just hooked another one up here. Can you help him? So this is just pandemonium has broken loose on the Pacific Dawn. If you couldn't say what fucking bluefish fishing is in a nutshell, this is it. This is it just all the way. Powering through a shitty day, and then of course on the way in, everyone's living. I, I might have my personal best. I'm close. Oh, here we go. I got it. Let's go. Let's go. Coming down. Coming down. How you doing, Billy? All right, guys, you gotta get down there to 50, 60 fathom. I got instantly bit. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. You're over him. Come over him. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, you guys are dancing. Get on your knee. Get on your knee. Use the rail. There we go. There right we behind, go. Right behind. Gotta get right through. Okay, yeah, you gotta come down. You gotta come down. Come down. Right behind. Just coming down. Yeah. You get, you get one on? I got him. Yeah. Excuse me, I gotta get up there, guys. Oh, man. Uh, you got one, Matt? Uh, uh, West Coast Jiggers. West Coast Jiggers. Uh, oh. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. Hold on. You see Rod? Snap. Snap. You third. You third. You third. No, 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 no. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right. Come on, Ryan. Grab a gap. We need a third up front. Third gap. Third gap. Coming up. Coming up. Watch out. Watch out. Oh, it's here. It's here. We got it. We got it. We got it. How was that, buddy? Incredible. Is it your biggest ever? I believe so. It's so nice. Okay, hey, follow me. We're gonna right. go down the side of the boat here. All right. Good job, guys. How you doing? Oh, we're gonna try and do it again. Did you get hit on the drop or the? I got uh, hit on the retrieve. Yeah. All right, who's got blue line? Right here. Okay, why it up? Okay, that point I'm gonna scare him all the way away. I see him on the horizon coming. Hey, never give up, don't doubt me. Yeah. You got it? You don't want to wind yeah, that all yeah, the way back up? Yeah. How are we doing up here? Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Uh, 
screen now, run. Alrighty. Are they still on the screen? Oh my god, yeah, they haven't left. picture that deck bloody deck. Yeah. camera's running right now all right you got your content guys stay on top of these angles all these lines that are going to the stars i got hit twice i didn't get hooked up all four of those lines right there follow your angles there you go come all the way to the stern all the way. We got five fish going back here. I want to get in before I get in their way. I know, same. We're coming over, guys. Take a step back, please. Here we go. Watch out. Oh, oh, oh. Welcome. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah. Hit the house. <laughs> Here, let me give you a shake the middle. Oh, there yeah, he is. Yeah, baby. Oh, Good yeah. job. Woo. Guys, that's a real one. one. That's how you do it. Who's this? Come oh, on, big guy. There we go. Great fish. So this was a fish from the other boat. They cut it right here. They're tying it to a fresh rod. Just, just, just do it, buddy. And, and I'll take that back if you need. Okay. But if you want to keep fighting, I'm happy to. Don't let it come undone. You want me to tie that shit, you got Wind that shit up. Whoa, whoa. Oh, no, you got to wind it on the reel. Wind that on the reel. Wind, wind, wind. We got deep color. Sorry, dude. I'm in, I'm in. I knew it. I'm tapping in. This is my second fish. I don't know how I missed the hookup, but I did. Yes, yes, us. Welcome in there. Take it out, guys. Take it out, guys. the white girl on. Yeah, I'm gaining. He was about 600 out. He's less than three now, so. No, I think you're actually killing on the hard way. I was just dying. My 
they fought. They fought. I fucking. They fought me, dude. This is something else has been. You want to crank this a little faster than me? I can, I can put some work in it for you. Okay, I'm sorry, man. Oh, you're all good. I got it. I just getting scoped out where their lines are going to be. Yeah. We called the Royal Pacific in because they hadn't had a bite and some of our fish were starting to get tangled with them and one of theirs got tangled with us and so I had Charlie reel it to get its head turned to get it coming back towards the boat rather than headed for the Royal Pacific. Look at this deck. Bloody decks loaded with big tunas on the Pacific Dawn. Good stuff, Charlie. I think we cleared them. If, if that's my leader coming there, it looks like it is. You're about 40 feet. Thank you. That fish was running right towards the Pacific, the um, Royal Polaris's lines. Feel some lines on it. You feel lines on it? I feel this one. All right, this one's that color right here. All right, right behind. Yep, right behind. Coming in. If you don't mind, I'm just gonna kill this thing. Absolutely. Right I'll let you. We're good, we're good, we're good. He came out. Perfect. We're trying to get him. Coming down, coming down, coming down, quick as fuck. Coming down. Coming down. Coming down. Coming down. Coming down. Matt, our fishes are doing a little dance there. Whew. Charlie, I thought you said you were gonna kill that for me. Hey, hey, man, no no It got chewed off? <laughs> we got Captain Mike Filming the fish coming in. We're about to kill another one. We've had him to lead her twice. How are we doing, Charlie? Doing pretty good. All right, man. You, you still don't mind holding him? No, I got you. Okay. The first one wiped me out. Things up and down now, so that's nice. Come on down and over. You're gonna come on over the top, all of us right here. Well, over me, then under this. There we go. It's amazing how one stop changed everything. <laughs> I don't think we're making it home on time. <laughs> <laughs> we are home. This is home. What do you think, Captain Mike? 
<laughs> Ninth inning, we're walking towards the dugout, thinking it's the last pitch. And we're hooked up. Overtime. Yeah, we're gonna be late back to the dock. Sorry, Marco. Okay, Charlie, when you get to the when you get to the floral, it's about 40 feet. Alrighty. He's he's been there a couple of times. Charlie, you got one? Yeah, Charlie's on he's on mine. This is a collective effort now. I know I'm out of shape. You've been pulling on that thing for like an hour, buddy. Not my fish. Huh? Not my fish. His, his fish disappeared. Oh, they did? Yeah. You're live right now. Don't cuss. Yeah, just happy. Nothing. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. We're all happy. We don't know that guy. I'll I'll let it. It'll be out. You edit it out? Yeah. I don't like to, but I will. I got it. Turn that head and get that thing turned over here. That strike there, that's about the max drag on this thing. Yeah, we're not going past it. Yeah. I appreciate the help. Yeah, no worries. Mike took it while I changed batteries on my GoPro. You, you got it for the kill, and then you let him run 300 yards out. I did. I wanted to give him hope. Maybe bring some friends home with him. That's right. What do you guys say about the Death Star? That's a good name. The Death Star. But it ends up blowing up. Okay, I guess you got me again, Charlie. The test on They got you again? Yeah, dude. I think they just put your fish on the boat. They Look at this line right to the right to the bow of the Royal Polaris. They got his fish. Oh, don't flip them off. I already have a lot. Yeah, don't, man. You're clear. I think somebody snagged your line and they pulled it up. And hey, got hey, I fucking felt it, dude. I felt the line rubbing on. Get over here. Got it. What do you think you're doing? Is he leaving again, Charlie? No, no, he ain't. He's trying. He's not going to. Ooh. Oh, it's a heavy one. Ryan, can I step in hey, on that side? Put that line, bring it on I'm down for me. On it. Hey, Jamie, you're right over here, buddy. I guess I could have told you I was towards the end. <laughs> Take that thing back to the corner. Come on, Charlie. Get control of my fish. All right, number two, Jim. Yeah, but it's really only one and a half for me. It's now a, it's now a team effort. Hey, never be ashamed. I'm not. I'd rather get it on the boat. That's what we're hoping for. He's been on long enough now. What's he calling him? The Death Star? <laughs> Death Star. Yeah, because he's lost two fish to him. Yeah. Mine was headed that way, so I handed it to Charlie. He got his head turned and brought him back this way. Good. <laughs> that was smart. Yep. Yeah, he's, there's two fish there. One fish, two fish, blue fish. Is there two fish there, on that? There's another one there. 
So there's two fish. There's two fish. Who's on right here? Do I have them both? Oh, that's a shark. Fucking shark. shark. Well, I hope he just takes the 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 propeller. Yeah. Oh, it's still a beat there, so he didn't take the fin off. I thought I saw blood. Okay, we got 40 feet. About. I started with 60 feet a liter. I think I'm down to about 40. There he is. We got color. Hey, Brad. Oh, we got color over here. The, the Royal Polaris stole Ben's fish. And they're running, running for the hills. What's up right here? Go let it fly. Ben, they got your fish and they're leaving. Yeah. yeah. Here, they're fish poaching off. Coming in right behind you. I mean, if I can pass it over to you with a jig, 300 gram jig, you're a little too close. Yeah, it's okay. They got here, they got some fish. Yeah, that's true. They made their day, made our day. Well, except for one of our guys. Yeah. It's mine. Yours? Yeah. I'm just, it was, I'm done. It was straight towards me. It was headed straight toward the Royal Polaris, so I Laura, handed it to Charlie. He got it turned and... <sighs> yeah, bring him up over this side. I'll get the best video. This sure has been fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah turned into a great trip, didn't it, Brandon? Yes, it did. We were all crying the blues. <laughs> yeah. Captain said, there's some fish down there. Everybody hooked up. I don't know how many we got. We got 15 or 20 on the boat right now, I think. This one is not wanting to come in. There was a shark on him, but... Come on, Charlie! Okay, they're gaining on him. He looks like he's still down 20 feet though. I hate seeing that on my fish. <laughs>
He's got some size to him. Since I handed the rod off, do I get to count it as a personal best? Was that on your rod? Yeah. Well, we need somebody to video. Yep. So that's. I want him. I want to make a good video for Mike, man. He's a hard-working captain. This whole crew right here. This is crew effort now. I got three crew members back here. You guys, this shit's gonna get back on us. It's off our starboard bow. It's coming back. Fucking giant, pardon my language, giant school coming back to us. We're gonna keep fishing until the stuff's gone. So, I, I need you guys to try. It's starting to surround the boat. Oh shit, we're getting wagon wheels. Almost got to the gaff shot. And then it looked like he just peeled a bunch of line back out. Cousin Jim and Charlie and Ryan. Oh yeah. That's the biggest one I ever hooked. That's the biggest one I ever hooked. Thanks, Charlie. Thanks, Ryan. And I forgot your name. Matt. Matt Brad. All right, thanks, Brad. This was a team effort. You guys did it, man. I swore I saw a bike mark. I I thought when I saw the shark down there, I thought yeah, I saw blood come out of him. You're gonna have to redo that. Maybe he ate the shark. Yeah, you hooked him right in the nose. He broke in my nose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you need to stick him. Yeah, you want that party? Everyone's about it. That's the one. Just fucking kick it. He's done. You got him. Thanks. There we go. I don't know. Maybe one, 160 maybe? Ryan, how big is that fish? 150? Yeah. 30 I guess. Yeah. I got two like that. Matt, great job, buddy. We had a blast. What's your first name? David. David? All right, buddy. We had a blast. Good job. Benny Hanna from Oregon. All right, Benny Hanna from Oregon. Woo! How many did you get? One. That's all you need. One fish. I'm good. All right, Billy, how'd you do, man? How many did you get? One. You got one. Good job. Yeah. That's awesome. And I know this guy was hooked up several times. How many did you get in? I only landed one. You got one in? Yes, sir. That's all you need. I know. I'm trying to get this limit right now, though. Oh, man. You're using the third hand there? Yeah. There was someone in here. Is it working? Right. Feels wonderful, doesn't it? Like a charm, man. Yeah, there you go. <laughs>
We're doing it, man. Oh, uh, we did it. Uh, Last we're second, we, we got him. <laughs> Woo. What time is it? 10 o'clock at night? I don't know. Where's that video going up? I know you got to come one of me. <laughs> I got them. I got lots of people hooking up fish. <laughs> did you get out there? I did. How many did you get? I got one. Good job, man. A nice one. I told you, you get out there, you don't have to buy fish. Yeah, I got one. And it's all good. I got around the boat twice. You went around twice? How many did you land? How about you, buddy? You got cut off both times? You landed one? No, one Only one hookup? Oh, wow. That, that was you and me up in the front. We both hooked up at the same time? That wasn't you? Okay. I think we hooked up at the same time, Cousin Jim. Oh man, <laughs> I thought I thought we were tangled and on the sonar thing and all of a sudden it's <laughs> we go, oh, I guess it's not the sonar. Yeah. The whole thing. You didn't have it on earlier? So did you I, use I, a good I, hook I, this I time? I thought I got out of bed. It was a good hook. And how many did you land? Uh, one. All right. That's way, way better than straightening the hook? Way better than straightening the hook. Good job, man. Yes, I'm happy. Matt was hooked up like four or five times. So the guy his first time I was like, that's blue fish in that shot. Yeah. So someone else cast. I need a fish count. Leaders. When leaders tied on. Roy said his fish are like 140 to 160 pounds. They have a lot of leader. Not when five when I'm casting, it's ripping my finger. So so when I got mine to the leader the first time, there was a shark on him. Was it really? Yeah, and so I, I thought we did you get like one? I don't know if you could see it or not. They're all over 100 except for like two. They're all over 100. Yeah. Except for like two of them. Yeah. yeah. I got right. I think I have the smallest. Just when you think this trip is over, it's not. Captain Mike found another big school. Wait until you see what happens in part two. We're going to be six hours late, but we're having fun.